There you go, design star. I will show you three steps to improve the jacket quick and easy. Okay, let's get to it. To improve on the jacket, first we want to fix this gap right here. To do that, I'm going to zoom in a little bit here. Then strengthen this pattern. After that, I'm going to this edit sewing tool, click on that and I'm going to click on the sewing and then come to the property editor. We want to change that to custom angle, full strength to zero and full angle to zero. Now I'm going to press on the space bar here to simulate. And as you can see right there, now the issue fixed. I'm going to repeat the step here. Once again, select this edit sewing tool and then click on that sewing right there. Go to the property editor and then change that to custom angle and change the full strength to zero as well as the full angle. Now I'm going to click on the space bar here to simulate and click on once again to stop the simulation. Next, we want to hide this seam line here. To hide the seam line, I will go to the vertical toggle menu, click on that t-shirt icon, and then hover the mouse to the right, and then click on that show or hide seam line here. And now the seam line disappear. Next, we want to apply the top stitches onto the jacket. To do so, first I'm going to zoom in a little bit here so we get to see the effects a little better. Next, I'm going to come down here to this 2D toolbar and click on this top stitch and we want to select the free top stitch. And I'm going to zoom in here a little bit too. Click one to place, then hover the mouse down here and then click once again to end. I will repeat the step over here. So click one to start, hover the mouse down here and then click once again to end. And we are going to apply more top stitches onto the zipper simply click right there and then hover the mouse down here and then click once again to end next i'm gonna apply the top stitches onto the sleeve cuff simply click one to start hover the mouse around it and then click once again to finish next i'm going to change the color to a little bit darker once again switch my tool to this edit top stitch and then come over here to this object browser, click on that single top stitch there. And I'm gonna scroll down on the property editor and I wanna click on that color and change it to roughly darker. So we get to see the top stitch a little bit better. Next, I'm going to click on apply and close. And there are one more thing that we need to do here. So if I look down here by default, I already have both. If you are not, be sure to click that to show both sides of the top stitches, okay? After that, we want to create double stitches right here, okay? To create double stitches, I'm going to click on that and then come over here to copy and I'm going to name it double. I will select segment top stitches and I'm going to click one right there on the skirt hem as well as right here. Next, we want to change that to double. To do that, change my tool back to this edit top stitch and click on that double there. And I'm going to scroll down here and change that to two. Almost perfect though. However, I want this lay a little bit up higher. Okay, so to do that, come over here to the property editor. If I scroll down here and number offset 1-16, I'm going to change that to one half. And finally, we are going to change the poses. I'm going to first strengthen the garment and then press on number two here. I want to see the entire avatar. Then I'm going to go to avatar folder in the library tab, then double click on it, then come to female underscore V2. And I'm going to select pose, double click on it and scroll down until I see dash 07, double click on that. and Leave everything as is and then click on OK. And I'm going to wait until it's finished. Now simulate one more time and then press on the spacebar to stop the simulation. Now I'm going to marquee select all the pattern pieces, right click and select unstrengthen. Okay, there you have a design star. I hope you guys find the video helpful. And if you like the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Encoder Fashion for more awesome video like this. Thanks for watching guys!